for the eight-year disaster of Opaseki and Aswe together. Yes. So on this day, I am very, first we give thanks to God Almighty that we did all those campaigns without casualty. That we did all those campaigns without any allegation against the candidates and any one of us missing the violence on any boy, anyone. Even when they planned and they did succeed in the killing his bodyguard in order to frighten him, God say, my son, who I have anointed, will not be frightened. So tonight, it can only be joy and joy and joy. I give all the praises to God, our Creator, yeah. that He has made His own son, who He has chosen to clean the mess of the outgoing and even not outgoing of Basaki and the fake artificial intelligence it was going to bring. <laughs> and though we now be governed by a combination of a man enriched with native wisdom, a man familiar with the custom and tradition of a state, a man who by his personal lifestyle is humble, gentle, but focused, a man who has used his personal resources to show love and commitment to babies, to mothers, to the elderly, to children, and to community. We can call him a guy who has huge credentials in terms of community services. A man who just look like me and said that he's younger, he's fresher, and he has better energy to do the job that God has now entrusted in his soldier. So I am a very happy man, I am a fulfilled man, and now I ask God in his evening powers to further enrich him with wisdom so that together he will make a difference. Let it be said, 10 years after his rule, People will say, during Senator Monday, now we get this school. During Senator Monday, now we get this hospital. During Senator Monday, now we get this room. For me, it's a personal fulfillment. And those who say there will be bloodbath, God has put them to shame. There is no single reported incident of anybody being shot during this election. There is no one who is in the hospital. So when the National Acting Chairman of PDP said there will be blood by I don't say no, there will be celebration. So for me, it is important that there is no violence. Even those who refuse to sign peace agreement they have been consumed by the war in their heart, not the war provided by anybody. So to God be the glory. Now, hello, ladies and gentlemen, I have the special honor, and I want you to listen, the special honor and real privilege to produce a man who God has created and whose parents, knowing his future, decided to give him God's will, God's will, no man's will common Senate president of the 10th Senate of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. He has come to a door typical of him to lie low, quiet, invisible, all in prayer that may the will of God prevail in this election. Who else can that be? The only Senate president in the history of Nigeria who, while he seated, encouraged, supported, mobilized and did everything that was within his powers legally and democratically and transparently to ensure that one of his own colleagues because he accepted us as his colleague 
even though he's our boss in the Senate, to support one of us to become a governor. And I speak of no one else. But the man who whose better is no hope what he will be when they name him God's will. At Pabio, the Okomo Senator, uh, the Okomo Senator of the 10th Senate of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. The man who has showed so much commitment to President Bola Ahmed Tinubu's vision for renewed hope. And the man who is willing to take all the bullets to ensure that the ship of state remains afloat using his legislative powers. For which I am proud to say he is my Senate President. Yes, God's will, I pop you. Thank you. How do you feel on occasion like this? Yes,